Within a few days, this is another second largest demonstration that's been held in Tirana. The square by the parliament is packed with supporters of the opposition groups. And you can see just how many people have come out here. A few thousand people at least, maybe five or six thousand. The demonstration started on the weekend when there were almost 10,000 people and that turned violent and people were arrested. There's no sign of that happening uh, on this day. But what the people are complaining about and what they are listening to, speaker after speaker talking, is against Eddie Rama as Prime Minister, against the governing party, against corruption within the government and also that the economic changes haven't really filtered down. They haven't really had an impact on the majority of people for the benefit of the majority of Albanians. So over here you'll see just how many people are listening to the speakers. Most of them are members of parliament, most of them are with two of the main opposition parties and what they're calling for is not just for Edi Rama to resign and for fresh elections two and a half years early but they're also calling for changes, for reform and they vow that they will not go back into parliament to take part in any democratic debate after this demonstration. They will basically give up their right as members of parliament and this is an unprecedented state in Albania with so many people now disaffected with the government.